Homeowner calls police after discovering gruesome surprise on porch. After a night away from home, a man pulled up to his house to see something suspicious on his porch. When he got closer, he was greeted by a horrific scene, courtesy of his two pit bulls. Before the video starts, please subscribe to join our community. Your support helps us grow and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Georgia police say that a homeowner whose name hasn't been released pulled up to his house in Noonan at 10.30 a.m. to find fresh human remains on his porch, Waga reports. Authorities confirmed that the mangled body of 21-year-old Alex Binyam Abraha was left just outside the resident's front door prompting the emergency call, while most pet owners worry about their animals tearing up the house. One homeowner returned after a night away to find that his dogs had engaged in activity far beyond the usual mess. In fact, it had him calling the police in a panic. Coweta County Sheriff's Office deputies arrived at the home to find the dead body of 21-year-old Alex Binyam Abraha lying on the porch. Investigators believe that Abraha had been trying to break into the home when he was mauled by the owner's two pit bulls. The deceased man was not known to the homeowner and had not been there the evening before. The Georgia Bureau of Investigation Medical Examiner determined the cause of death to be mauling. The official report suggests that Abraha may have broken into and entered the home before he was quickly met by the defensive animals. Investigators say that Abraha likely tried to escape as soon as he encountered the dogs but was attacked. Evidence suggests that he eventually managed to free himself of the animals and exit the home. A preliminary investigation concluded that Abraha's wounds were so severe that he barely made it onto the porch before he succumbed to his injuries. Deputies confirmed that Abraha had several active warrants out for his arrest in Fulton County. His family, however, maintains that there has been no evidence that the deceased had done anything wrong. They are demanding answers from the police. Per protocol, the dogs were seized and handed over to Coweta County Animal Services. While the investigation wraps up, police say that no charges will be filed against the homeowner. The dogs have been turned over to animal control and nothing has been determined as to what happens next for them, Nix told the station. Across social media, many have expressed concern over the fate of the dogs. Some were worried that the pit bulls might be destroyed by animal control for merely protecting their home and themselves. However, Coweta County Sheriff's Office later confirmed that the dogs will be held in a 10-day quarantine and then will be released to their owner. The family claims they weren't notified of Abraha's death until several days after the mauling. They refuse to accept the results of the autopsy and are continuing to search for answers. Still, the question remains as to why Abraha was at this residence in the first place. If Abraha was indeed invading the home, the dogs deserve extra treats and pets for their trouble. These canines were simply defending the property and their lives, and the home was just as much theirs as it was their master's.